Five Daughters is, is uh, the real story of uh, five young women who worked as street prostitutes who were murdered in Ipswich in the winter of 2006. Uh, we, in order to make the film, uh, we went through a very long research process, um, starting initially with the police who had investigated the crime. Uh, and moving on uh, very gradually uh, to be introduced to the victims' families. And uh, with the input of the police, the families, and some of the young women's friends, uh, we put together a film which we hope is told, given gives an accurate account of what happened to those young women in the weeks and months before they were murdered. Why did you get involved in this film? Well, I, I was asked to get involved in this film, I think because I've got a documentary background, so used to making things about real life stories, and also I've made quite a few dramas as well about real life stories. So because this sort of project needs a combination of being able to interview people as well as then turning it into a dramatic narrative. I think that, that's why. And um, also because the story is such a powerful story and I felt that the, the women in this story had been so misunderstood in the press after and during the murders. They were very much described as prostitutes. But as soon as we started doing the research, we, we, we discovered these very ordinary girls who were really drug addicts and that's what had driven them into that world of prostitution but they had all these other qualities that were, were lovely and normal and they came from very normal living homes which is not what you would think about street prostitutes and I think for me it was a very important to be able to tell the story of these girls real lives and that they were ordinary girls who loved their mums and had sisters and that they uh, had been vilified in the tabloid press, uh, vilified and dismissed, and, and um, the Daily Mail in particular had effectively said that uh, they'd got what was coming to them. And I think instinctively we and a lot of other people felt that uh, nobody deserves to be murdered in the way that they were murdered, and that these were stories that probably were worth telling. And I think as we did the research, we discovered they were more than worth telling. What do you hope the audience takes away from the film? I think that, I think a realisation that these women were actually ordinary girls with the same hopes and dreams as us all. And that you can't really label somebody. Um, you've got to look behind the label and find the real person. How difficult was it to conduct some of these interviews? It was very, very emotional and, and it was um, a, an enormous privilege to be allowed to listen to those stories because the, the mothers who gave their permission for us to portray their daughters and them had never really told their story to anybody before, apart from, from the police during the investigation but they'd never really been asked about what their daughters were really like. And so it was actually incredible to be able to sit with them and listen to them about what had happened and about how all of the mums had desperately tried to help their daughters get off heroin. Um, and to hear their struggles um, was very, very moving. 